Hey guys, it's Brianna. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video, I am going to be deep cleaning my house. But before I begin, I want to thank you all for all the love and support. Now, let's get into this video. So the first thing I do is I come into the kitchen and start cleaning in here. And what I'm doing first is doing the dishes. Yes, we do have a dishwasher as you guys know, but we do not like to using the dishwasher because we feel like when we do it by hand, it gets it way cleaner. Now I'm going to dry them off and put them away. So now I'm moving on to the stove and I'm wiping it down with pine saw and bleach mixed together. Now I am removing everything that was on the stove and I'm going to be wiping the knobs and the top of the stove off. After I get done wiping the stove down, I am getting all the things that was on the stove and wiping them down and putting them back up there so that there's no dust or anything on them. The next thing I'm doing is I'm wiping down the countertops with Lysol bleach mixture as I did with the stove. This just makes your house smell really good and it gives it the best cleaning sensory that you could ever have and it's just really good to use. Now I'm moving on to my mom's coffee station and I love wiping this down for her so that in the morning when she sits down and drinks her coffee, it can smell clean and look clean. And I love wiping this down like I said and I'm using the Lysol and bleach mix together. Alright, now I'm moving on to the fridge and I'm wiping down with the Lysol bleach mixer. And I just wanted you guys to know that I'm using different mat rags as you guys can see in the bathroom part when I'm cleaning that. Um, I just tore up an old towel that we don't use anymore and I cut it into little pieces so I can use it for rags. Because you know, it, it's towels that we don't use and it's just good and you guys should do it too if you have towels that you don't use. It just saves a lot of money and a lot of time. 
Next, I am moving on to the countertop beside the sink, and I am taking everything off and wiping it down with the Lysol and bleach mixture. You guys should try that. My mom taught me it, and it makes your house smell really good, and it makes it clean. I'm also wiping down the dishwasher just because, you know, you got to be clean. you got to wipe down everything just because of what's going on right now and just because you got to be clean. And I'm putting down this fall little towelette thing so that it can be the decorative season of the year because it is and i'm putting everything my mom had back up there and i actually love the way she decorates and has everything set up nice and neat This is my favorite part. I am mopping the floor and I love doing this. This is my favorite part because it makes it feel like you're not walking on dirt and it's actually really clean. <laughs> Now I'm in the dining room and I am wiping down my uncle's keto cabinet with some paper towels and Windex with vinegar in it. Vinegar and Windex actually make the like the best clear glass you've ever seen. It's not like normal Windex that has your glass foggy. It just makes it clear as clear as glass as you can see. This wasn't really dirty. All I did was wipe it down with Windex and vinegar, the microwave, and then I'm lighting a fall candle just to be decorative. As you guys see in the fall video, you guys should go check that out. Next, I am taking everything off and shaking the tablecloth off and then putting it back up there and wiping all the candles and everything that was on there and putting it back. I just do this so that if there's any food or anything that got on it, which there shouldn't be, but if there is, I just don't like the, the imagining that that's gross and you just, that's just nasty. <laughs> I'm almost finished with the dining room, but first before I leave, I have to make sure I sweep the floors. This is a big area, so it's really hard to sweep, but you gotta make it work, you know. You gotta have that gypsy blood in you. Now I'm moving on to mopping. As you guys know, this is my favorite, 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 favorite part. You guys should know that from all my cleaning videos. I always said this is my favorite part, which it is. I just love the feel of cleanery on my feet. I just don't like walking on things, like feeling dirt. Like if I feel like I'm sweating, I have to take a shower. Like I just can't deal with that. As you guys know, my mom's a really, really clean person and she grew up, up clean and I'm really glad she did. Now I'm going around spraying some stain remover on the ground so that I can vacuum over it and I can steam clean the floor. So now I'm moving on to steam cleaning the floor. You don't want to make the floor soaked. We do this like two times every month i believe because you don't want to make your carpet mildew and it just be soaked underneath and it could probably fall through the next person's ceiling you don't want that to happen so we do this two times a month and it like our floor is not that dirty it's just you know we have a dog and accidents happen and also drinks and stuff like that so we gotta make sure we clean our carpet and my mom as you can see is in the background this is the first time she's never been in a video 
like she's never she's always been in one of my videos this is the first time she isn't and <laughs> that's like so weird because then you start bringing in all my cleaning videos but yeah i just wanted to let you guys know that you guys um that this is my first time cleaning by myself without my mom in a video with me and yeah that's really good <laughs> but yes as you guys can see right now i am steam cleaning My mom wanted to show off her melting candle and so we are putting a scent in there, a fall scent in there and this makes our house smell so so good. I am moving on to my brother's bathtub and I'm filling it up a little bit and I am adding some bleach and I'm taking a rag and I am wiping it down, you know, just because of germs and if it's just dirty as you guys know my mom never grew us up dirty she always wipe the baths about not because she thinks we're dirty but that's just clean that's the way of living for gypsies and if you're not a gypsy and you don't do that i'm not judging you i'm just saying this way gypsies are and every gypsy is like that After I get done wiping the bathtub out, I am moving on to the sink and I'm putting the toothbrushes and everything down so that I can wipe the sink off with the bleach and Lysol mixture that I made. The last thing I do is clean the toilet because I'm afraid that I will accidentally use the same rag and I don't want that to happen, which I know I won't because my mom would never let that happen. I just, you know, get scared so easily. But yeah, I'm lighting a scent for her candle and she's putting the same one so I can light up and smell my brother's bathroom up. Now I'm moving on to the toilet. I'm removing everything that is on his toilet and I am wiping it down this is the most important part just especially because if people use his bathroom you know it's just a safety thing it's clean as you guys know i'm not judging anyone but that's just the way we are as i keep saying we have to make sure our house is totally 100 percent clean this actually took me about three and a half hours i started at two o'clock and ended around five four or five and this talk all day even though it's like a 20 minute video So I want to make sure you guys know I'm really thankful for every one of you guys. You guys are so amazing. I'm at like 1,066 subscribers. I want to thank you guys so much. It happened so, so fast. I woke up one morning with 700 subscribers, 800 subscribers. You guys really did it. I'm so thankful. Now I am sweeping my brother's bathroom. I'm mopping the floor next and I'm using the bleach and Lysol mixture and I'm getting on my hands and knees and using a towel to wipe it up or a rag, a towel that I cut up, but I'm using it to wipe it. It's because, you know, if, if anything like is dirty, if there's anything on the ground, you know, you just got to make sure it's 100% clean. As I keep saying, you want to make sure you wash your hands after you do the toilet and the ground just because that's nasty. So make sure you wash your hands.
Now I'm moving on to my bathroom and I'm starting with the sink first because my sink was really messy with all the perfume and stuff we got. If you guys seen my birthday haul, I got a lot of stuff from my brother's sisters and family. You guys should go check that out. But now I am removing everything from my sink and going to wipe it down with bleach and Lysol mixture. So we were actually running out that's how much i used today so i kept filling it up with the bleach because we was running out now i am going to be wiping down the sink Now I'm putting everything that was on my sink back on there, which was my perfume, my Victoria's Secret perfume at that, and my Bath & Body Works perfume, and everything that I got for my birthday, and my toothbrushes, mouthwash, everything that was up there, and I'm glad it's all clean now. Next, I removed everything from my toilet and I'm cleaning my toilet and then I'm doing the bathtub last. So I'm doing it like I did my brother's because just because I'm not a boy doesn't mean I can't, I don't have to clean my toilet. Everybody does wipe the sides and everything down. That's most important. You need to and you just, it's just a have to thing with gypsies. We have to do it good and clean it or don't do it at all. That's our saying. Now I'm moving on to my bathtub. Um, I have a mat in my bathtub now, and you know, when you take a bath or a shower, it goes on there. I need to clean this every single day because it's just the thought that just makes me bleh. <laughs> But now I'm removing everything from my bathtub, and I am going to fill it up with water and fill it with the bleach mixture. Next, I'm wiping my mirror down with the vinegar and the Windex mixture. As I said, this helps really, really good. My mom made this up and it's just so amazing. Well, she didn't make it up, she found it and it just made it so good. It makes her bathroom smell like look amazing, smell amazing. I just love it. Next, I am sweeping and mopping my floors. I mop my floor every single day and I sweep my floor every single day just because it might not get dirty or messy every single day. It's a have to thing. I do not like walking on one piece of dirt, one rock, anything. I have to pick it up. It's, it's just something my mom taught me when I was little. I just don't like dirtiness.
So now I am mopping my floor. This is the end of the video now. Um, this is probably the fifth hour I've been cleaning and I'm exhausted. I'm used to it though. I have to do deep cleans probably once every two or three weeks. You know, it's just a have to thing. You know, either I do it or my mother does it. My dad goes out to park, of course. But yeah, here's me mopping the floor. Here's the overview of my bathroom. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you like, subscribe, and turn on the post notifications. Go follow me on Facebook, and there will be more information about my merch. It will be in the link in the description box below. I love you guys so much. Bye!